You know, Gok, I have a funny feeling Betty's eyesight is getting worse. Come on, Maxie. You've gained so much junk in your trunk. I wonder what she can see. There it is. Why am I even walking? Mission Green Biscuits! Yeah, but I need to be alive to eat them! Max! <laughs> Excuse me, but is this the pet shop? Sure is, but you can't bring that in here. <laughs> Some animal lover you are! <laughs> I'm not looking forward to the journey home. Mm. <sighs> <sighs> Thank goodness that's over. Fish and cream biggies coming right up, boys. Fish and cream. <laughs> Even their name sounds like moonlight. <sighs> you have to try them, some of them. A couple. Yeah, you can have one. You should try them. <laughs> we have to fix her useless eyes. Say, you with the useless eyes, have I got a deal for you. Over here, follow my voice. Come to the Fly-By-Night Laser Eye Clinic. Here's your bill. I don't want to see. I don't want to see. That's it. We can't afford it, Gark. We'll just have to do it ourselves. Yeah! That's exactly... Wait, what? Well, I can do lasers. Ah! We're talking precision optical surgery here, Gark. Oh, you mean like this? <laughs> Ah, I do make a lovely masterpiece. So, how are we going to do this? Hmm? Got any anaesthetic? Oh, hello. The... That'll work. This'll be easy. First, I'll just remove these weird pieces of skin over the eyes. No! They're her eyelids. Oh, gosh. The things you learn when you're performing surgery. Well, here we go. <laughs> Whoa, no arguments there. What a lovely sunny day. Better get some sunglasses. Oh, a documentary on fires. Sure hope they'll have some hunky firemen. Unbelievable, she's worse than ever. Only now she's destroying everything I love. We have to stop her. She'll burn the flat to the ground. <gasps> and we'll end up penniless buskers. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah! I don't know how. Unless she has a reset to default button. I got it. We'll take her to that laser surgery clinic. They've got to have a customer complaints desk. But we're not customers. That's my first complaint. Come on. Scratch, scratch already. Walkies? What a good idea. I could get some new sunglasses. Everything's so bright today. Let's see what's on. 
Sensation Cream! She's destroying everything! Look up! Oh! Simpson, don't just stand there like a pile of carbonized ash. Let me more too. Yes, my lord. to show. Everything works out fine when you do home laser eye surgery. Attention, Athlons! Our race have always lived in peace. Until now, surrender or face our wrath. Oh, he sounds so strong and masterful. Ah, oh, you've done and done it now. Here comes the action sequence! You monster! This is war! <laughs> oh, it's so interactive! Ah! Ah! Hi! As the representative of Earth, let me say, you can have what you want! Just don't hurt me, just don't hurt what? me. What? Seems your laser weapon... Betty? ...your Betty destroyed what was quite near and dear to me. And now I'm going to take what is near and dear to you. Oh, um, this is a bit awkward, Gark. Does it soften the blow to know you're near and dear to me? Not really, but I understand. My lord, I am Gark, and I am prepared to serve you. I don't want that. I want... I want your biscuits. Biscuits? What oh, biscuits? Those are... Just holograms of biscuit boxes. Nice one, Gok. <laughs> and let this be a lesson to you. Nobody messes with the imperious race of the googly eyes. Simpson! Sorry. I Brooks. I could never tell which one of us he was looking at. A very cunning race, the googly eyes. Hey, speaking of eyes, time to get Betty's eyes fixed. Yeah, that went well. What a fantastic ending! Here you go. Treats for my peeps. Cheer up, Max. I'm sure it'll wear off. Eventually. Yeah, until then... All I got these. I wonder if they taste better toasted. <laughs> it's all right. I can do laser tongue surgery. <laughs> what could go wrong? <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
Now, Gark, the hocking up of furballs is an illustrious tradition that requires style and grace. Watch. <laughs> Voila! A perfect furball. Can I do it too? Go for it. <laughs> Look, Max, mine has its own moon. Lux emotion. Completely underflammed. Okay. Oh, look at me. I'm Gark. I can hawk up fur balls the size of small cars. I'm so cute. If I were an alien, I could do that too. <laughs> What's better than being an alien? Taking their technology without asking. <laughs> <laughs> How to cough up bigger furballs. Terms and conditions may cause heart to explode. Bloody, 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 blah, boring. Mm, except. Hmm, delivery time, four seconds. Oh, there's the that's possible. <laughs> yes. Gawk. <laughs> Gawk. Gawk. Oh, hey, Gark. You're up late. How did you learn that? I didn't want to show you up earlier, but I'm actually a bit of a furball master. I could keep doing this forever. said forever. I didn't think you meant it. Shouldn't you stop? I can't! I downloaded a furball enhancer from the Codex. Max! <laughs> I think the last one had my spleen in it. No, still in here. <laughs> I think that's all of them. Uh, let that be a lesson to you, Gark. Never agree to terms and conditions without reading them first. Uh-oh. <laughs> it's a horrible monster! No, Max. It's a germinal multicellular eukaryotic diploid. What you call a bobby. Meep. A baby? Like I said, a horrible monster. No, this is good. I've heard having an incipient life form changes you. Changes you? Me? I'm out of here. See ya. What are we going to call him? I'm not going to call it anything. It's a giant flemmy furball. Meep. Something mysterious, like Dwayne or Brenda. Will you hold this if I name him? Okay. Fine. Uh, let me. Meep. Now talk to him using his name so we can get used to it. Oh, okay. Oh, let me. Meep. Get off me. Look, Flummy, I made your dinner. <laughs> I don't think that's the right food for him. But what do you think he'll eat? Not my problem. And this is a Mega Zappa Particle Bazooka! You can... Lasers are dangerous! <laughs> See? I downloaded a parenting manual. It even shows you how to build a playpen. <sighs> I'll just put your toy in. Okay, Flemmy. In you go for playtime. Flemmy! What did you do? I was just following the parenting manual. This isn't the manual. 
It's a death prison thing. Well, at least I was trying. Oh, I see. Now it's all my fault. Just because I didn't lie you coughing up better furballs. And just because I stole your codex. And just because I refused to take responsibility for what I created. Oh, my fault then, is it? Uh, yeah. Meep. <sighs> Guess it does put me in a bad light, doesn't it? But from now on, I'll take care of everything, Gark. Just like I always do. And I'll help. Just like I always do. First thing to learn, grooming. Glide and scrape. Glide and scrape. Now you try it. Excellent, Flemmy. Ah. Flemmy, watch me. <laughs> Messing around. I'm trying to parent here. Hmm? Let's try the litter box. Carefully step in. Max! Betty just bought us a huge box to play with. Come on! I don't have the luxury of playtime. I'm a little busy here parenting. <sighs> Let's try something less messy. Playing with cat toys. Oh, yes. <laughs> it's so much fun. No, Doc. Playing with cat toys is a serious matter, requiring an enormous amount of skill and concentration. <sighs> 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 Now, your turn. Flemmy, like this. Oh, Flemmy, are you okay? Meep. Duck, just stop helping and leave me alone to parent. <sighs> Come on, Flemmy. You can do it. You can walk. Meep. <laughs> <laughs> you rest now, my little Flemmy. Max. Reassess! Meep. What is it, Gark? Betty's left a ball of yarn out. Since Flemmy's asleep, I was wondering if you wanted to unroll it with me. Gark. I have to chart Flemmy's sleep patterns. Max! We never get to have fun anymore! You don't have time for fun when you're being the world's greatest single parent to a farball. Maybe you and Flemmy and I should... Uh... Uh -huh. Did you not hear world's greatest single parent to a farball? Now run along, Doc! <sighs> Flemmy! <laughs> Time to get up! Flemmy? Come on, buddy! I've got the whole day planned! Meep. Huh? Excuse me? Meep. <laughs> yeah! Something's happened to Flemmy! <laughs> There's no life in his eyes! He just sits and does nothing except say, Meep! Like, Meep! No! Like, meep! What's happened? Help me! <laughs> I tried to help before, but you yelled at me to stop, so I stopped. Oh, <laughs> so that's your little game, is it? Refusing to help until I apologize. No, I was trying to do what you asked. Fine! I was wrong, you were right, I got carried away, blah, 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 blah. Apology, apology. Now help me, God! Meep. Meep. Oh, I think I know. Oh. He's become a stage two bioorganism. What you call a teenager. A teenager? <sighs> they grow up so fast. Like 24 hours fast. 
So, there's no way we can change him back? Nope. Meep. Meep. Look, Max. A flock of Flemmies. He needs to be with them now. So, I'll never have to worry about his emotional needs again? I guess not. Meep. Woohoo! by us, Flemmies! Yarn. 